The first treatment was incredible. I didn't know what to expect. I like to call it Dr. Dubin in his magic carpet ride. I mean, I was running around happy, and I thought, wow, this is what normal feels like. I don't think I've experienced anything like this. My background is actually as an emergency room physician. I was an ER doctor for 10 years in uh, primarily in inner city Boston. Uh, after doing that for 10 years, I actually ended up starting a healthcare consulting company in occupational environmental medicine. But I've always been interested in brain and mind going all the way back to high school. So when I looked into neurofeedback, I found that there were clinical applications also. Uh, and I was also extremely aware how little other physicians and other clinicians knew about this. LENS stands for Low Energy Neurofeedback System and it's unlike anything I've ever seen in medicine. I've devoted myself strictly to doing neurofeedback in general, but particularly lens neurofeedback over the last few years. This is all I do. The attacks were random. They just came. There was nothing that really brought them on or um, triggered them that I knew at the time. And uh, it would be this feeling of pressure on my inside my body in my head and like something was pushing me down and not allowing me to actually function. I couldn't finish things, I couldn't think clearly about which um, tasks I should tackle first so um, in general I would have uh, the experience of being overwhelmed a lot and um, that produces more anxiety so I didn't know what I was feeling like. All I knew was that um, my life uh, was just this giant struggle. I was uh, uh, using, I felt like I was using all my energy all day to be happy. I was experiencing dread, terror, uh, kind of, I'm not here, I have children, I was looking at them as if I didn't exist, I couldn't see the next moment happening, I couldn't imagine the next breath tomorrow. It works by influencing brain waves in such a way that it allows the brain to move past, get beyond uh, frozen dysfunctional patterns. We have a sensor on each ear and then a sensor that we move around on the scalp. This measures electrical activity in the brain, just like an EKG measures electrical activity of the heart. So the electrical activity is measured, it goes through a small amplifier and that amplifier goes to a computer via USB port. That's all the equipment involved. It's very simple, but it has very sophisticated software. The equipment and the software tracks what the brain is doing. And at a given moment, it sends back an extremely tiny signal to the brain, a signal that's far less than a cell phone and for just a fraction of a second. But it causes a slight fluctuation in brain waves. And that slight fluctuation allows the brain to break free of frozen dysfunctional patterns. So it's like pushing a restart button on the brain, and it allows the brain to go back to its original patterns. My first session, I walked out of his office, and I was walking down the street, and I remember crying. But I wasn't upset, I was crying because I was happy, because I was, for the first time, felt normal, and I was like, wow, look at these trees, and the birds, and the light, and everything's great, and I'm crying because I'm happy. And I remember being on one of these other drugs going, I couldn't cry, even if it was, you know, my whole, everything had gone wrong in my life. It was just like, oh, I'm this thing. It's set me free. I um, immediately felt a sense of clarity that I hadn't in a very long time. The anxiety is much more manageable because um, it's not as acutely in my body. I'm not having heart palpitations. I'm not... Um, experiencing the same physiological symptoms. It's more of a mental process that I have a lot on my mind and a lot of decisions to make. A friend suggested that I uh, come to Dr. Dubin, so I said, oh, okay, and I saw the change in him immediately. He'd been to two sessions, and I said, hmm, what got into him? He's all friendly and wonderful. How'd that all happen all of a sudden? And so I went just thinking that, you know, maybe something small could happen, but it was much larger and much more impactful on every aspect of my life after only a few sessions. From the first electrodes that were put on my head, I suddenly had a sense of this side of my head opening and I had some conduit of clarity to be able to think from the first, the first blip. This isn't diagnostic specific. 
it optimizes brain function. So if you have ADD, your ADD improves. If you have depression, your depression improves. If you have both ADD and depression at the same time, they both improve. Once someone has gone through a series of treatments for ADD, for example, that's it. They're done. They don't have to continue taking uh, medication. All a patient has to do is sit there for a few seconds at a time. There's nothing for the patient to do. Uh, it's also extremely benign in terms of its temporary side effects, which are just dizziness, spaciness, headaches sometimes, all very temporary. And in terms of how fast it works and that the changes are enduring, we can do it all uh, without medication being a problem. There's nothing like it. There's really nothing like it. And I usually just say, well, it's Dr. Dubin and Lenz, and I'm like, what is that now? Because they know I've done a lot of stuff. Now what? But they, they, can't, they can't say anything bad about it because it works this time. You know, it's not like, oh, I've done this class, or I've read this book, I've seen this video, or I did this thing, uh, this weekend or whatever. No, this is like, it works. And I say, look, if you want to have what I have, you need to come see Dr. Dubin, it's that simple.